Hi, I'm Marty Rosendale, CEO of the Maryland Tech Council, and I'm here today with Rick Wazorek, who is the president and CEO of the NIH Federal Credit Union. Rick, welcome. Well, thank you, Marty, and thanks for having me. It's a pleasure. So, Rick, could you take a minute and tell us a little bit about yourself and the credit union? Sure. So, uh, um, I'm the president and CEO of NIH Federal Credit Union. Uh, we uh, were founded in uh, 1940. Actually, we're celebrating our 80th uh, birthday or anniversary this year. And uh, we started at NIH, National Institutes of Health, uh, by about nine employees, like many other credit unions in the country. And uh, so uh, we're a credit union, and a credit union is sometimes compared to banks. We're very different, though. And it starts at the top, Marty. It starts with our board of directors. They're volunteers. Uh, we have, uh, they don't get paid. And uh, we're a not-for-profit. So we are designed to, to make money to pay dividends and to pay our employees, but we're a, a not-for-profit and uh, we don't have shareholders to answer to. My main mission as an employee of NIH Federal Credit Union is to make sure that our members are, and are getting a good deal. So. So I'm curious, you know, most people think you, because of your name, the NIH Federal Credit Union, that you'd be limited to NIH employees. Mm -hmm. That's not the case at all. Uh, in fact, just recently, the credit union uh, has uh, received a new charter by our, our federal agency that oversees credit unions called the National Credit Union Administration, NCUA, that allows us to serve uh, virtually uh, anybody. Um, but our focus is the healthcare and biomedical industry. So not only do we serve NIH, but we also serve nurses, doctors, dentists, um, associations within the whole biomedical community. That's, that's great. So what would you like future customers to know about the credit union? Why, why, why is it unique? Why the credit union instead of the, a local bank? Well, we're about people helping people. We are designed, and it's in our DNA, to make sure that the people that use our cooperative are getting the very best deal. And it's not, all, it's not about the profit, it's about truly people helping people. And I've been a part of the credit union industry for over 30 years. My dad was a general manager of a religious-based credit union out of Detroit. And, uh, and I'm very passionate about our mission to provide good financial services to consumers. So Rick, is there anything that we haven't talked about that you would like the uh, attendees of the conference to know? Well, yeah, I think uh, it's important to know that uh, many people think of credit unions as for car loans or for say consumer loans, you know, signature loans, credit cards. But at NIH, uh, we're one of the few truly healthcare focused credit unions in the entire country that offers not only consumer loans and mortgages, but also business loans. And so we actually are a, an SBA, Small Business Administration lender, uh, and we provide uh, business loans to, uh, to doctors, dentists, uh, and we also have a strong focus on our uh, partners. And so for instance, if a company uh, that employs biomedical healthcare workers want to use us as a form of a benefit. So we call it our NIH at work program. So we can come in to the uh, organization now virtually and provide financial advice, uh, budgeting advice, uh, and also just you know, uh, you know, the ability to actually connect with us uh, virtually as well, which is uh, something that we're really proud of. And bottom line too is here's another big difference is that as a CEO of a credit union, I am available to our members. This is, I think is a real, truly big difference. I have relationships with our members. If they have a question about how their dividends are being calculated on their shares, they can call me. If they have a question about anything, I am available. That's something that you're not gonna find at a Bank of America, Wells, or some of those large organizations. Very, um, and, you know, they're great organizations, however, that personal touch I don't think is available with those larger institutions. No, Rick, that's amazing. I, I, I can tell you from experience, you're not, you're not gonna get an audience with the president or CEO of Bank of America or even your local branch um, if you've got questions like that. So that, that's an amazing offer, I appreciate it. 
Uh-huh. I, want to, I want to take this opportunity to thank you for your support. You've been a tremendous supporter of the life sciences community within Maryland, a supporter of the Maryland Tech Council. So I want to thank you for that. Yeah. And uh, just again, this is Marty Rosendale, the CEO of the Maryland Tech Council. And I'm here with Rick Wazorek, who is the president and CEO of NIH Federal Credit Union. Rick, thank you so much for your time. Thank you. Have a great conference. Thanks.